You are who God made you to be. You can't be anybody else. Yeah, I decided that I'm not gonna let people walk over me anymore. You know, I'm talented, I'm smart, I'm charismatic. I have everything going for me. Why am I allowing everybody else to dictate my movements? Um, I think of my life as a journey where I just, there are no limits. You know, whatever you feel in your heart, you want to do and you can do, I really believe that you should. Oh no, you know, I've, I've heard the comments that, you know, I think I'm better than people, but, and, I, I, and I've always looked like I'm upset. It's re I, really? Exactly. And, you know, the minute you talk to me, it's like, it's brilliant. Like, I'm like, what, really? I look like that. And they're like, yeah. I'm, I had a really low self esteem in high school. Okay, maybe not really low. But it was low, you know, as a tomboy, as one of the boys. I played every sport, I wore basketball shorts, drop it on my hip, big t shirt. Couldn't talk to me as a gangster mm -hmm. in high school. And, you know, it was one of those things where. I had to come into my own like at 18 19 you now I started to when I met my one of my best friends she kind of brought me into the more girly side like I wanted to be oh I was like oh being girly is cute I wanted to be a girly girl you now and started to branch out into that and then the, the, my first year of university I decided that I'm not gonna let people walk over me anymore you know I'm talented I'm smart I'm charismatic I have everything going for me why am I allowing everybody else to dictate my movements you know and I just decided that that was my decision when I was about 1920 that was my decision to self-confidence and I never looked legacy I want to leave behind Saudi is to inspire people especially our girls I realize that it's, it's so easy for us as women to lose passion and to lose focus I want to remind them how beautiful they are you know no matter what skin color no matter what height no matter how you look you're beautiful and it's not about being the best it's about being your best that's something my mom drilled into my head from a very young age don't compete with anybody don't red eye for people things be your best and once you're your best nothing nothing can can stop you you know just be true to yourself and i want to remind people how um important it is to follow your dreams you know i know in jamaica we have this thing where if you're a banker you're just a banker if you're a doctor you're a doctor exactly no if you have dreams you should follow them because you don't know what's going to happen you have absolutely no clue. Life is so unpredictable. Follow your heart, self. Figure out who you are first. It took me a while to figure out who I was because as I, I was as bad at a lot of things and I was good at a lot of things. So you have to figure out who you are, figure out what you love, find your passion, stick to it, build on it, learn about it, and stay true to who you are because you can't be anybody else. You are who God made you to be. You can't be anybody else. So when you finally wake up and realize that, hey, this is me, there's nothing that anybody can say to use anything against you. So I want you guys to just focus on yourself. Don't compete with anybody. Don't be jealous of anybody. Don't envy anybody because your life is yours.